What are the differences between public and private schools in the U.S.? 1. Funding and Tuition Public schools are funded by state, local, and federal taxes, making them free for families within the district. In contrast, private schools rely on tuition paid by families, along with donations and endowments. This results in significant tuition costs, which can vary widely. 2. Curriculum and Standards Public schools follow state-mandated curricula and educational standards, offering a broad range of subjects. They must adhere to state assessments and testing requirements. Private schools, on the other hand, have the flexibility to design their own curricula, allowing for specialized programs and innovative teaching methods. 3. Admissions Process Public school enrollment is based on geographic zoning, with students attending schools within their assigned district. Private schools use selective admissions processes, which may include application forms, interviews, and entrance exams, allowing families to choose schools that align with their preferences and needs. 4. Class size and teacher-to-student ratio. Public schools often have larger class sizes and higher student-to-teacher ratios due to budget constraints and high enrollment. Private schools typically offer smaller class sizes and lower student-to-teacher ratios, providing more personalized attention and support. 5. Extracurricular activities. Public schools provide a range of extracurricular activities such as sports, arts, and clubs, but availability can vary. Private schools often offer diverse and specialized extracurricular programs due to their additional resources and smaller student populations. 6. Teacher Certification Teachers in public schools are required to have state certification and meet professional standards. Private schools may have varying certification requirements, with some focusing more on experience and subject expertise rather than formal certification. 7. Diversity and Inclusion Public schools generally reflect the diversity of the local community and must comply with federal and state non-discrimination laws. Private schools may have varied levels of diversity depending on their admission policies and organizational values. 8. Facilities and Resources The quality of facilities and resources in public schools can vary significantly based on local funding. Private schools often boast well-maintained facilities and specialized resources due to their additional financial support. 9. Religious and Philosophical Orientation Public schools must remain secular and avoid promoting specific religious or philosophical views. Private schools may be affiliated with religious organizations or have specific educational philosophies, influencing their curriculum and school environment. 10. Accountability and Governance Public schools are governed by school boards and must adhere to state and federal regulations. They are held accountable through standardized testing and performance metrics. Private schools are managed by independent boards or administrators and are accountable to their stakeholders, including parents and donors. Conclusion Understanding the differences between public and private schools can help families make informed decisions based on their educational priorities, financial situation, and values. Public schools offer free, regulated education with broad accessibility, while private schools provide specialized programs and smaller class sizes, though they come with tuition costs.